Hi, I'm Jennifer Tryon, and I'm so excited to introduce you to build a block and show you exactly how this system works. It's really a game changer for anyone who wants to get started with quilting, but is a little unsure about how to measure and cut and get accurate piecing. It's also for the veteran quilter who is done with all of that rotary cutting. Okay, let's open it up and I'll show you exactly what I mean. All of the dies come in this block. It's a drawer system. We've got quarter square triangles, half square triangles, and of course, Course, squares. So the whole system is based on these thin metal dies. Scrapbookers and card makers will be very familiar with these dies already. They're not sharp, they have a cutting edge, and the Gemini, because it's so strong, pushes that die down through the fabric. All the pieces measure between an inch and a half and six and a half inches, and they all come nested in these drawers. Easy for storage and easy to see their shapes and sizes. And don't worry, there's a booklet that comes with tons of different designs and even more to download. The biggest question is how many layers can I cut? So, the Build-A-Block system is designed to perfectly cut about six layers of fabric. Now, it is going to depend on the quality of your quilting cotton or if you're even cutting cotton at all. So we like to tell people to test it out first. I've gone as low as six but up as high as 12 especially if you're bringing in your metal shim. But the real advantage of the Build-A-Block system is to be able to take a pre-cut piece like a fat quarter or a fat eighth and not have to do anything to it. Just fold it up and cut it. And now I'm layering this fat eighth on top of this white fat eighth and that way I'm gonna cut both at the same time. This is eight layers of fabric. You don't need brand spanking new plates for this to work. You can see mine are well loved and they'll still go through the machine. Best practice with your plates is to always be rotating them and flipping them after each cut before you cut your next time. So the instruction book will tell you exactly how to sandwich up the plates for cutting. But here you go. You're gonna use your clear plastic cutting plate. I'm gonna use my metal shim, but depending on how many layers, you don't have to put the metal shim. Then I'm gonna put my fabric. Then I'm gonna take my die and place it exactly where I would like it to cut on my fabric. Then it's plastic shim and then your top plate. So you can see there's no hand cranking, everything's totally electronic. Now watch this. Eight pieces, perfectly cut. All right, let's keep going. Now you can always hear the machine working in there. There's a bit of a crackling sound as it pushes the die through the fabric and into the metal shim. That's totally normal. There's another eight and another eight and another eight. That's 32 triangles in seconds. Very little waste. Cool, right? The other thing that's really great about the Build-A-Block system is that the quarter inch seam allowance is already built in to the size. So all you need to do is put right sides together and stitch from this point to this point and you've got a perfect quarter inch seam. And with everything stitched together, now you can really start to have some fun. Start choosing your design or use one of the pre-designed ones. When the shapes are guaranteed to line up every single time, you never have to worry about whether or not your pattern is going to come together. And soon enough, you will have an heirloom to show for it. Because when you can get an accurate cut right from the start, it means your final piece will always measure up.